Tottenham Hotspur Stadium in London, England. It's the NFL International Series on EA Sports. So now this offense will take over and they will have the football at their own 20 yard line. Here's the first carry for Ezekiel Elliott. And he'll take this ahead for about four. Second down coming up. Simply not much more you can ask out of your running back. Over 100 yards and the three touchdowns. And for an old coot like me, I loved it because he did it on the ground. A running back taking control of the game. And that's what I like to hold see. On, hold on, an old coot? Coot, C-O-O-T. All right, I'll look that up later. Give him nine there on the first down completion. Here's second and a yard. Here's Newton. And his throw here is incomplete. Well, you know, this club, there were some reports earlier in the week, and most have heard this by now, the so-called unnamed sources that were saying, all is not rosy in that locker room. There's whispers that one or two guys, CD, have kind of had enough of how things are going and have been going. How would you handle that as a coach? Well, you and I both know all the coaches that we've dealt with and come in contact with. They'd love to get their hands on those unnamed sources, wouldn't they? But they know that that's not possible, so I think they've got to go in there and make sure that this isn't a distraction. They also know that once the grumbling starts, it becomes a slippery slope and it's hard to stop the fall. But I think you need to sit some guys down and say, hey, look, we're still hoping to be a playoff team this year. We need you guys to be bought in with what we're doing. Come on, let's get on board. And he will get this to the midfield stripe, but that's not going to be enough. He's a few yards short. Escaping the pressure. Cam fighting. He lost the football. It's out. And it's scooped up by the Jets. And he'll return this one just shy of midfield to the 49. About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. And they have the game here followed by the open date on their calendar next weekend. And Charles, this is a crew that you have to think really is relishing the opportunity to be on the couch for a few days. Yeah, they certainly are, but let's face it, partner. They can't get caught looking ahead to that couch time while they're playing this one. They've got to take care of business first. Yeah, that one drops down incomplete. Good coverage there, forced the ball free, and it's second down. Back to the air, Newton on second down. And that falls to the ground incomplete. A nice job of bodying him up defensively. And now it brings up third down. So back-to-back -back incompletions, and that has him staring at a third and ten. Here's Newton. He rifles one that's intercepted. Picked off near the 42. set to begin their next drive the Falcons offense at the line they threw an interception the first time they had the football wound up leading to a touchdown the other way how do you approach drive number two going back to your game plan coming in everyone has matchups that they like better than others where they think they have an advantage dial up some of those plays try and go to those spots and get your offense moving to throw once more on second and ten. Newton, he'll fire deep downfield for Lamb. A fight for it, and this is caught. What a catch. So the big play changes the complexion of things. Here's first and ten just outside the 30. Cam's throw taken in by Samuel. And he'll go out of bounds inside the 15-yard line. And this has been a nice answer to the touchdown drive against them a few minutes ago because they've come out and reestablished the tempo. A nice throw there, and they're putting together a very strong... And he'll take it into the end zone. Touchdown, Atlanta. Ezekiel Elliott. Now following the interception.
interception. This offense will get another shot at it as so they'll quickly head back onto the field. They'll start the drive with Elliott. And he'll manage to pick up about four. It's second down. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. A give to Elliott. And he'll get it down here to the 43. 62 yards rushing for him as he has been tough to stop here this first down. And that's a nice pickup of a first down on that second down run. And at that yardage game, they can run that plan any down. On first down, it's Elliott. And they'll get him down after a pickup of eight, second and two. Eight yards the tally on that first down run. Here's second and two. The give is to Elliott. And he's got this down almost to the 20 before he's dropped. So after a good run by Zeke, another first and 10. Now a handoff here to his running back. And this will be a gain of six when it's all said and done. Down to the 15 from the 21. Now after the running play, we've got a man down on the field. The last run got six, now second and four. Well, he gets attended to, we'll step aside. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. Call that a loss of a yard, and things get a little more difficult here, third and five. And he picks up the first as he's able to take it down to the seven-yard line. They're going to run the sweep. It's Samuel. And the hole closes quickly here. He can fight only to about the four. Second and goal from inside the five. Mostert. And he is into the end zone for a Falcon touchdown. Raheem Mostert. His... All right, the offense back out there now. Let's see what they can put together. They start on the ground with Elliott. Uh, he's tackled a yard short of the marker. Good gain of nine on first down. The previous run, good for nine. Here's second and a yard. And taking it across midfield and inside the 45. They'll run on first down. It's Elliott, and he'll take this forward for about five as we have come upon the two-minute warning. Coming up at halftime, I'll go from one personality, that's you, Charles Davis, to another one in Orlando, the coach. He'll have stats and scores from around the NFL. You and Jonathan Coachman, both larger than life. No doubt about it. But you're stuck with me in this booth. <laughs> yes, and he's I miles am. away and smiling. And happy. On first down, Newton. And brought in by the tight end, Cook. And down inside the 15, shy of the 10. And they're going to speed things up here. On first and 10, Newton. Over the middle, complete to Samuel. And the stop will come inside the five at the four. Seven yards, the pick up there. And he'll take it into the end zone. Touchdown, Atlanta. Ezekiel Elliott. So the offense set to take the field here. They will have the football with less than a minute to go in the first half. On first down, it's Elliott. And he'll take this up only to about his 18-yard line. The last run got a couple. Here's second and eight. Newton now to throw. He completes it to Julio Jones. And past the 40 before he's out of bounds. We often, with Cam Newton, talk a lot about timeout if they hurry. We'll see. So the big play means just like that, they'll operate from the red zone now on first down. Now Newton. And that will be incomplete. Four ticks left here on the clock. Normally you think the tight end's going to be able to catch the football and handle that contact, but in this case, maybe a little too much target to hit. That one was timed well. Incomplete. And this one is no good. He missed it. And this score will stay right where it is. The 
this offense ready to get back out there as they'll have the football to start the third quarter. Second half starts with a carry by Elliott. And not a whole lot of room to operate there on the first down run. He gets maybe three. On second and seven, Newton into the secondary past the 40. And finally brought down right at the midfield strike. And the offense moving quickly to the line. From the 50, Newton. Over the middle, and there's a diving catch. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Now Newton. This complete to Jones. And all the way inside the 15 before they drop it. And quickly, they get to the line. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. And that is incomplete. Oh, the coverage a little too good there, and it's second down. Once you get into the red zone, space is at a premium for receivers to try and operate and shake themselves free. That one's incomplete. A 20th carry here for Elliott. And they get to him quickly here as he stopped right around the 13. <laughs> Throwing on third down, Newton. And this is caught on the sideline. But no, they'll say out of bounds. He caught it but was not in bounds. Incomplete. They failed once in this spot earlier, but the offense will stay out to go for it on fourth down. They snap it to Newton. And it's incomplete. They cannot convert, and they turn it over. So the football will be at the 25-yard line as this offense gets set to take over. They'll run on first down. It's Elliott, and maybe a measure of revenge there. He's had his way in this one, but this time they get him behind the line. Officially, it's a one-yard loss. That's going to bring up second. Oh, that's into a sea of bodies, and it's intercepted. Picked off near the 44, and he's going to take this one back to the 37-yard line. About set to begin their next drive, the Falcons offense at the line. Their lead down to a field goal now as they start with a first and ten. And the coverage terrific there as that's knocked down and incomplete. A good action to this point in the third quarter. Just a three-point game. Second and ten. Throwing is Newton. Looking left side and he's got a man. That's Jones. And he's taken down but able to slip across the 35. And they're going to hurry back to the line now. Newton's throw pulled in by Lamb. And he'll be corralled out across midfield down to the 45. Three quarters in the books. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. So signs of life in what's been a dormant offense in this second half. Here's first and ten. Well, a nice throw here right side. He hauls it in. First down, it's Elliott. And he's going to get a solid gain of nine before being brought down. Second and right at a yard. Elliott going to get it again on second down. And they work this near the five. He'll be stopped at the six. 160 yards rushing now for the NFL leader coming into this ball game. No doubt those are the types of carries they're looking for here, Charles. The lead in the fourth quarter. This is when coaches that have a reliable running game, they breathe a little easier on the sideline. Yeah, they love the idea that they can take the air out of the football at this point of the game. That means they're really counting on that offensive line. And he is into the end zone for a Falcon touchdown. Ezekiel Elliott. Offenses have been clicking in this one. A lot of points on the board. We'll see if that trend continues. They'll try to run some clock now with Elliott. And he's able to plow forward up to about the 29, just shy of the 30. So they'll come up after the gain of seven on a second and three. 
Taking a shot for Samuel. They got his man complete. And he's taken down right at the 45-yard line. This is something you got to be wary of defensively. I mean, just because they're in the mode of trying to burn some clock doesn't mean they won't pass it. They got good yardage out of that one. Yeah, and really, when you're looking at it, now they've got a fresh set of downs. Look for second down. If they want to take another shot and try and loosen things up, that'd be the time to do it. Once again, it's Mostert. And they'll be inside the 35 now at the 34-yard line. Not totally free yet, but it's looking good as they come first and 10. Faster run past the 20. And all the way down to the 17-yard line. Three points separating these two sides with two minutes left to go in the fourth. So it's Falcon football as we welcome you back. They've got a first and ten as they look to try and finish this one off. And they corral them just a couple yards shy of the end zone. So fresh out of the two-minute warning, and here's another timeout taken with 1.55 remaining. It's first and goal and a late touchdown at this stage. Could officially salt this one away. They'll run with Mostert, and this will result in him losing yardage. Back to the three. And now with 1.52 to go, we get another pause in the action. A timeout here defensively. So they're backed up to the three-yard line, second and goal. That would give to the big fullback, Juszczyk. And he will take it in for a Falcon touchdown. Both offenses have been clicking in this one. A lot of points on the board. We'll see if that trend continues. Throwing here, Newton. And that is incomplete. Fair to say the secondary play, whichever side you're on, hasn't really been a glowing exhibition so far, but a nice job there to prevent a long completion. I agree with you, but at some point, someone had to make a play and try and stop this exhibition. A diving effort, but only right at the line of scrimmage. The Jets going to go ahead and use their final timeout as they'll get it with just under 90 seconds remaining. The Jets will bring in a nickel set as they try to stop this third down. Now Newton. And he takes a shot on the release as this will be incomplete. Oh, that's got to frustrate him a little bit because they nearly got to him there, and it would have been the first sack of the game instead. They're able to influence the release, and they did force the incomplete pass. They'll run it with Elliott. But he will have the first down before he's tackled at the 12. I have to chuckle to myself a little bit, Brandon, because right now, I could be in that huddle with that offensive line, and I know exactly what they're saying. If you call a pass play here, we're going to... And intercepted! Maybe the turning point they need! Picked off by Mike Hilton, and the Jets are right... Charles, we saw a lot of points go up in this one. Certainly defensively, stuff that they could look at on film, don't you think? Doubt about it, and they've got to go back and...